Hey guys, Kev here, and I have a probably the most special unboxing that I can think of on this channel before. This package is from Vero Engineering. Joseph over there is an awesome dude. So is his wife, Michelle. Uh, they are such cool people. And I have um, tried, I think, all of the Vero's that are out there, except for uh, I handled the Neuron at uh, Blade Show. I did not pre-order one of those. Or the Frame Lock Axon is the only one I haven't actually had in my hands, I think. Um, which, it's a right-handed frame lock axon. Doesn't make sense for me to get that one. I had the liner lock version, and I really enjoyed that knife. Um, really, my biggest issue with it was the clip. And, you know, it wouldn't really... It was very tight going in pocket, right? And that was my, that was my really only issue with that knife and why I sold it. But today marks a momentous occasion in the knife community. And, and I'm not kidding. Uh, this In this box is a left-handed Axon liner lock. That's right. The lock is left-handed. The clip is on the left side. Um, for one of these boutique type brands to do this is very, very very important right now in the knife world because it means anybody can do it. Um, the excuse you get all the time is, well, it's only 10% of the population. Why cater to them? Especially when half of them will just carry a right-handed knife anyway, right? The other argument is these guys can't keep right-handed knives in stock. Why would they bother messing with lefty knives? Well, the king of 32nd pre-order sellouts has come out with a lefty knife so suck it everyone else and thank you joseph all right stop my babbling 20.5 clip point let's get into this i think there's also some stuff for my giveaway in here 2k giveaway is currently going uh grateful panic has hit the 1k mark as of like an hour ago so, I will be doing that giveaway on Lefty Live. So, let's see what we got. All right. We have the Lefty Axon. Oh, I'm so excited. Cool Vero pouch or patch, sorry. We have a bunch of Vero stickers. All right. All this stuff that I'm showing you now is going to go into the giveaway. Oh, uh, look, new stickers they have. Really cool stickers. These little square stickers. Look at that. So the patch and the squares. Oh, and there's car decals. Check that out. Car decal for Vero. Shit, I might keep that. Uh, there's the candy that I love. Oh, and check it out. There's a Vero Hank in here, guys. So there you go, that's a giveaway item right there. Mighty Hank's Vero Hank, that's cool. All right, so somebody lucky is gonna get all that stuff. Man, I don't know if I can give away that car decal. I kinda wanna pop it on the truck. I don't have any decals on the truck, so it would be the only one, but you know what? The man appreciates me for being lefty, so, you know, he's not left-handed. Nuh-uh. He's just cool like that. All right, let's see. Ooh. All right, bang. So you get your cool Vero pouch with the patch. Mix those words up. Awesome cloth. Ooh, there's a COA card. First run, Vero Axon, M390, DLC, DLC configuration, black carbon fiber. This is the end cut carbon fiber, I think. And it says lefty, baby. Lefty. Can you tell I'm excited? All right. All right you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and put the Demco in here. Because I'm going to start carrying this immediately. There we go. Here it is. Oh. So, 
What ha happened is they came out with these. Man, it's got a little more weight to it than I remember. I like it. Um, they came out with these. Uh, he told me about it at Blade Show, and I basically have been bugging him ever since about it. Um, and this is this has all of the changes that the Gen 2 liner locks have. So it's a first run of lefties, but it has all those changes, like the clip has that plateau on it. I, it does look like some good clearance. Look at that. We'll see, but it looks like it. Um, I think the flipper or the front flipper might be extended a little. I don't know. Uh, okay. D10 feels a little better than the one I had. Um, but yeah, so he got them in and told me about it. And I was like, oh, yeah. Um, I need one. And he thought he had all the configurations, but it, when he went to QC them, he found out he only had DLC and he had the end cut and he had g tet red g tet so i said screw it give me a murdered out chow one i've never had one like that it'd be cool to finally get a knife that's all murdered out chow um and then i was planning to get a second one to give away but i didn't want to get it in dlc so i'm gonna wait and see if either i'll get it on the drop or maybe i can get the hook up again <clears throat> and uh so from there, I'll kind of piece together the one that I really want, whether it's this or my Carta with satin or a combination, and then I'll give away um, the other one. So anyway, look at that. It's stunning. Let me give this sucker a flipper. Yes. Yes. Joseph. Oh my goodness. Guys, I really do love the axon. Look at this. Lefty. Look at this. Lefty. Lefty. Can I get a lefty in the chat? Oh, it's not a chat. Sorry. Ha! Oh, my God. Dude, it's left-handed. Oh, it's got the front flip going. Look at this action. Dude, murdered out is kind of nice. Kind of nice. Lock up is fantastic. No play. No lock rock. Look at that. Bang. No lock rock. That used to be a thing, I think. Well, I don't remember if it was on the Axon, but it was on some of the other models. It's just how they were. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's sharp. Look at that blade. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if anybody remembers my original Axon unboxing where I creamed my pants. Well, guess what? It happened again. The Axon is the pants creamer of them all. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm so excited. Uh, look at this end cut. I've always wanted to try his end cut carbon fiber, and I, I always go with my Carta or titanium because I'm a slut. Uh, oh, look at that. You can see it on the back there. Oh, it says Vero right here on the spine, and this is number 470. Uh, all right. Thumb flick. Thumb flickage. Thumb flickage. Now, the detent's not, you know, hey, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if I just give it a flick, as soon as it breaks, it flies out. So, if I act like a normal person and bang it, it bangs. All right, I know what you guys want to see. You want to see it right-handed. I know. I know. All right, hang on. Welcome to my world, bitches. Now you gotta push this over and then hang your hand down like this. Get it past. <laughs> How's the clip? All right, it's still a little tight, but these pants are thicker than most that I have. And it does, you know, I just gotta shove it in a little bit, but I can one hand it out. Can I one hand it in? Let's see. Yeah, I can one-hand it in. It's not perfect. I do wish there was more clearance, but fuck, man. I'm not going to complain. Thank you, Joseph. You are the man. Uh, in all seriousness, you are the man. You have made my day, possibly my year, by making this knife. Uh, I've been waiting months for this knife since you told me at Blade Show. And you, sir, are a scholar and a gentleman. You are the man. 
the myth, the legend, Joseph Vera. <laughs> Dude, oh my goodness, I could not be more excited. I could not be more excited. Oh, God. All right, cool. That is the left-handed Vero Axon liner lock coming in hot. There is no um, there's no release date yet for this guy. Um, I think he's waiting for the other batches to come in, obviously, uh, that are, you know, have the satin blades and the stonewashed blades. They're going to come in all configurations. There's at least 470 of them, I guess. So I'll definitely be getting a second one. This one, yeah, man, it's better than the um, the first one I had in my car. It feels like the scales are thicker. I love the carbon fiber, man. It feels fantastic. Uh, and I actually am into the murdered out chaw. So look at that action. I mean, it's a lefty knife that I actually want. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a model that I actually like and want, and it's left-handed. Usually, I buy it because it's left-handed, and then I get used to whatever it is. All right, guys, my phone overheated because I was way too excited about this knife. <laughs> what I was saying was... Um, it's an it's a model that I actually like. I bought this in the right-handed version, and I liked the knife a lot. And now it's in lefty. That's awesome. Because usually, I buy the knife because it's left-handed, and then I get used to whatever it is. Unless it's a Leong Ma, who technically is a boutique brand as well. Um, so Leong gets a huge shout out here as well for being a lefty-friendly guy coming out with uh, great models in left-hand carry. And when you have knives like this. That are flickable and everything. Having them be left-handed is very important. Um, it just it, it just makes it more fun, uh, you know. Um, if you have a knife like the Field Duty and it's right-handed with a full frame line, it's just not going to work, right? Like the Field Duty EDC, I would never buy that if it didn't come in a lefty. So anyway, I've rambled enough. Um, I love you, Joseph so much for doing this um and i really hope that all the other boutique brands out there and other brands in general take goddamn notice joseph has put you on notice make lefties for us lefties i guarantee you these will sell okay we'll see when they actually drop i know i'll buy another one I might buy two more. I might buy five more just to have them because they're fucking left-handed and they're awesome. This knife is incredible. It's incredible. And it's lefty. It's all for me. Uh, so anyway, thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart, Joseph, in all sincerity and honesty. On behalf of all the lefties in the knife community, thank you, sir. You are the man, okay? Um... And I love you guys. I really do. I hope you have a fantastic day. I will, because I have this now. And I will catch you later.